Nnam the cannot win in today's hearing as Tunubu is tagged violating international law. Order to release Namdekanu with immediate effect. All right, Nigerians, passing Namdekanu's trial for today is a shocker. As um, Bolame Tunubu, as government, has just been tagged, um, you know, um, violating the international law and um, the international um, rules and regulation. Um, of course, you, 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 you are not supposed to keep a British citizen for too, for too long and then um, not so even are we talking about too long you know you, you you're not even supposed to detain a british citizen it is completely um, a, a, a violated law and you understand it's and also a slap to the cheek of of of, of the british government okay so um I think this, uh, this is more or less like a reminder to him and giving him um, the automatum to release Namdekanu without time wasting. What could this be? Let's quickly go straight to the content. This is today's news. The indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, has urged the federal government to withdraw from the ongoing legal proceedings against its leader, Mazi Namdekanu, and release him unconditionally accusing the government of ethnic persecution. In a statement released by IPOP Media and Publicity Secretary Emma Powerful on Monday, the group described the continued trial of Mazi Namdekanu as political and ethnical motivated. The IPOP also accused the administration of President Bola Tunubu of violating international law by continuing to prosecute Kanu, who was allegedly kidnapped and transferred from Kenya to Nigeria by the previous administration. The noble family and movement of the indigenous people of Biafra IPOP, led by the great leader Mazi Namde Okukano, hereby drew the attention of the public towards the kangaroo persecution of Mazi Namde Kano by the Nigerian government. We view President Bola Tunubu's led Nigerian government's continued Kankaro persecution of Mazen Namdekano in another court sitting on 24th September 2024 as ethnic persecution, the continuous, continuous illegal court trial of Mazen Namdekano is nothing but political and ethnic persecution by the incumbent government of Tunubu. Despite the Court of Appeals judgment that discharged him, which is still subsisting, yet the Nigerian government has continued his trial. The statement read. That's it. They, they have violated it. They have abused it. They did not just violate it. They abused the, 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 the international law. You understand? They have abused it. Can, can the same thing be done to... To, uh, to to Nigerians, except the Nigerian person is in committing a crime which is um, internationally, uh, you know, uh, internationally uh, uh, dismissed and not acceptable. That is when that uh, that is when a Nigerian can uh, can now be, be be tagged to go through such. Uh, such a a, 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 detain, a detainment or such an arrest. So, my dear people, with what has just been revealed today, I am of this strong opinion and confident that Namdekanu might be released today. So, I want to urge every my every dear friends and also members to remain calm and confident because God is on the throne and has taken charge, full charge, I say. All right, let's quickly go straight to the content and then let's know what your opinions and what your take on what has just been revealed right away. Maybe it is a pleasure. Don't forget to click on the right subscribe buttons as well as the bell button is to get updated each time we upload any new videos.
Thank you.